Are you sure that you choose the best model of laser cleaning machine according to your cleaning applications? Are you sure that the machine you are using now has the best cleaning quality and the fastest cleaning speed? Hello everyone, this is Jelly. Welcome to the Mac Laser channel. In the last two videos, me and Julia has introduced the difference between pulse laser cleaning and CW laser cleaning. In the second video, we introduced the difference between single mode and multi mode pulse laser cleanings. Today, I'm going to take a few minutes to explain the, the main specifications of the laser that affecting the laser cleaning speed and quality. First specification is the power of the laser. Power of the laser doesn't fully decide the cleaning quality or speed. This is the biggest misunderstanding that many newcomers they will make it wrong. They always want to choose higher power, which probably means they get higher speed or better quality. No, it doesn't look like that. The higher power one certain thing is that the higher power you get, the higher cleaning speed you get. So it, it very much influences the cleaning speed, the speed efficiency, but not doesn't mean that it has the much bigger or the same kind of more cleaning power or ability. The second specification is the beam spot size, which means the size of the laser shot on the workpiece. Laser work with different materials, so the real diameter of the beam spot might be different with the one that you read from the laser menu. And we can adjust the beam size through the beam pass. Third specification is the pulse energy and the power density. So besides the laser power and the beam size, we can hear the pulse energy, which means how much energy of every single pulse. For example, our 200 watt laser cleaner, the standard model is the single pulse energy is 1.5 millijoule. It looks very small. Many customers ask me, oh, it's a very small pulse energy laser. But this is the most powerful laser cleaner you can find on the market. Why? Because the spool is very small. If you take the pulse energy, then if all focus on very small spot, means you get very high power density. This power density can do the damage threshold, like uh, you need to melt or vaporize the contamination that you want to clean. So how much power you need to do that? We call it the damage threshold. So we also we have another model that have five millijoules, the pulse energy but you get bigger beam spot. So if you have less the power density, so if you have the less, the, the weaker cleaning ability, because it can do lower damage threshold. So this sounds a little bit hard to understand, but this is, this is the, the key point that affecting the machine's cleaning speed or ability, especially the ability. So, um, there are also on the market, we can see some other brands of lasers, they have uh, 200 watt, like Rekus, they have the Pulse Energy, 10 millijoules. Yes, it's a, it's a, it looks like, sounds like a big, bigger power, but the beam spool is much bigger. You get even less the power density. <laughs> if we both to clean uh, the strong painting or very thick painting, or the thermal barrier coating, those need higher damage threshold. This 1.5 millijoule laser with higher power density can clean it better. So this is the, the model that we, we choose to be our DMK laser cleaner, you know, the standard model, because we want to give the customer, you know, the strongest weapon that you can clean everything. Doesn't mean you clean everything in the fastest speed because the power density is like that. But we want to give you the possibility that you can clean everything from thin contamination to thick contamination. So it's a possibility. If you want to start a business with this, you of course want the diversity. You want to clean everything. You want to do business. So this is 
the reason that we want to choose this. Um, if you just want to buy the machine to do specified cleaning, like uh, very thin contaminations, little rusty, or oil, or like, you know, very simple work, we can offer uh, less power density, like five millimeters to 10 millimeters lasers. But, you know, we, we have that model as an option, that our standard is one for five millimeters. This one is the cleanability machine. Let's take a look at the, the beam sport pictures that you can read the single mode and multi mode difference. The fourth specification is the beam sport repeated rate, which means how many laser sports you got in a single minute or second. This, this factor is decided by two uh, sides. First is the frequency of the laser, second is the frequency of the scanning motor which is moving the mirrors that eventually moving the laser beam. Uh, the laser we are using is from JPP, the best mobile laser manufacturer in China. They have the widest frequency adjustment um, width and durations, so you can have very wider um, working parameter tables to choose the right parameter for your cleaning applications. So here we can have we can come to the conclusion when you are choosing the laser cleaning machine not only the laser power is the main reason you need to consider but also the other factors like we're talking about here today the house energy, the power density and the beam spool size and the beam spool re repeated rate those are also you need to consider and also the, the contamination that you want to work with the kind of uh, contaminations or what is you want to work with. Based on all that information, then you can you finally choose the right model. Now let's take a look in different scenarios for different kind of materials how to choose the most suitable laser. like it please give us a like or subscribe to our channel this will help us to move forward if you have other puzzles or questions please leave us a comment we will answer you in the first minute thank you for watching bye bye TMK laser is the leading laser machine manufacturer from China who are devoted in providing the best performance laser machines with the most affordable prices for the massive end users all over the world we will provide a professional technical service before the sales and after sales.